so I just came on here to show y'all the amount of boxes that I need to unpack and go through right now okay like today is Thursday so it's two days after my birthday now and I had to dive head first into mommy and work mode um, I do feel a little overwhelmed <laughs> because I have orders to fill and somehow, not somehow, but I just switched over my website from WordPress, WooCommerce to Shopify. And I didn't realize that there's an option to continue selling items that's out of stock on Shopify. So when I updated my inventory on Shopify before I launched my website again, there were certain things that I have out of stock and I made sure I put it zero online. But when I started getting orders and I'm like, wait, how are they ordering this? It's out of stock. I went into the back office and checked and I saw the little box that said continue selling when out of stock. And that box was checked on all of my products. So I had to go and uncheck them for everything. But <sighs> thankfully, my shipment came in on time. In fact, a lot of the boxes came in the day before and on my birthday. So I have everything. But now I need to make, I think it's like two or three products that I need to restock on that I have orders for. And I wasn't trying to rush to restock. I was trying to give myself a little break in between. But now I have to do it ASAP in order to fill those orders. So I am about to, um, just, first I need to clean and organize my workspace because everything is just disorganized. I've been, my focus has been like getting shit done to launch my website so everything else kind of went on the back burner including household stuff so I have like five baskets of laundry to fold do not judge me um, I don't know how I became this person back in the day I hated leaving laundry in the basket I, I wash dry and fold all in one day and now <sighs> laundry to have me in a chokehold okay I can't I cannot some, every time I get on top of it, something happened and I fall back behind. So, yeah. But I'm not focusing on laundry right now. So I'm just going to move all the laundry to one side of the room. <laughs> Clean my workspace. Start unpacking the boxes. I mean, opening on and unpacking the boxes. And clearing my environment so that I can get into production mode. Creating my products and stuff. So... Oh, my head is itching. One of the things that I need to restock on, I needed my damn self. My hairspray, like I need my hairspray and I'm out of, like I finished my bottle too. So <laughs> I need more of my Yoni wash and I'm out. Like it's crazy. So I'm going to start restocking and then I have other computer work to do. I have some emails I need to respond to and um, Tasha, if you're watching this, I'm going to respond to that email. I promise you. If not today, then definitely tomorrow. But my, it's on my, it's on my list of things to do for today. So it's time to get busy. Oh, so let me show y'all all these boxes. Now the living room is like a little storage area. I have to go through. I'm sorry I didn't clean up my messes when I made them. <laughs> boxes. Wait, it's time to be a hero. So yeah, um, I'm in my closet, my closet slash my storage closet, whatever you want to call this. But this is where all my ingredients and supplies are. And I need to organize in here. I took most of the stuff from up there because I want to be able to store stuff up there. And as you can see, a whole bunch of stuff up here. I need more space <laughs> my the next step in my business is getting some space there is I'm not gonna go into that right now but I really want to build my work studio and I already have a place like somewhere in on my parents property where I can do it so that's my that's my goal I want to build my work studio because I'm running out of space I have way too many things and um, I hate feeling. Burger! 
like I'm in a clustered Mama! environment and I Mama! yes baby Look. yeah Dad. you telling on him but you're doing the same thing no. don't leave him he no. knows how to come down no. come down bungo no. don't pull him don't pull him no. both of you come down no. leave him no. Nazir no. this child let me show y'all real quick. He tell his brother come down so he could go up on there. And he the youngest. No. Okay, come down. Come on. Let's go. They're not allowed in this closet because every time they come in here, they mess with things. Let me show you what Nazir did the other day. So he opened my um, mica powder. And look at all of this. There's mica everywhere, all in there. I gotta wash all those over, clean it. And I hate cleaning. It gets everywhere. It gets everywhere. And it's like, no matter how much I sweep and mop, I still see it. <sighs> Last year, Saya opened my green one, and it was everywhere for months, <laughs> I swear. So, um, they're not allowed in here. And that's another reason why I need my own my work studio so that my living and workspace are completely separate because these children oh my gosh when they get to exploring they don't break shit for me throw out stuff spill stuff what to do <laughs> so yeah i need to organize all of this i gotta take those butters these butters um and put them in these containers I gotta put I'm gonna store my um, some of these jars that I have underground I gotta go through and see which bottles here are empty to make room for the new stuff that I got and I have herbs that I ordered to fill up the jars that are either almost empty or um, all the way empty so yeah I gotta organize this shelf because over time it just become like this. <laughs> so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and start. And right now it's 11.49. Now they're playing on my bed. Right now it's 11.49. I have acupuncture at 2.30 and my, um, my oldest son I have therapy at 2.30. Yeah, insane. However, both appointments are literally right next next to each other in the same complex. So my goal is to leave here by 1 so I have time to go pick him up from school and get him settled in his appointment, go next door to my appointment, and then, yeah. Wait, I don't have the car, so I gotta call my mother and make sure she's here by 1. That's all my rambling for right now. Um, I don't know what else I'm going to film in this video. Uh, I might show y'all me opening the box. Let's see if I could figure out how to set that up. Okay, I'm making progress, y'all. So I've been clearing up my workspace. So it's looking mighty clear and organized over here. And I've moved all the boxes <laughs> in here. And I was going to... Go ahead and start opening them. It's already after one. It's like one oh one oh nine. So I'm about to head out. And then depending on how the rest of my day go, then I'll open it. So for now, I'm making progress. Now that everything is in here, my children were out there jumping up on all the boxes, so I had to move them. So um progress, y'all, yeah, progress. Okay. So I'm back home. It's probably minutes to six right now. We're probably already six. Yeah, it's six or six. So the sun is setting, so the, the lighting might go down, but I might do a time lapse of me opening these boxes because it's just too much to actually do an actual video on. Like, I don't wanna do that. I don't wanna be taking my time and opening and showing y'all like, oh, I got this for such and such. No, I'm just gonna open these boxes, get them unpacked, because tomorrow I have a very busy day and I really want to get this dealt with today. Alright, so I just finished opening all the boxes.
I'm a little upset because once again one of the jars, the boxes of jars that I buy came broken. So I have to call Amazon, make them give me a refund or send me a replacement. Hopefully they could just send me a replacement because I need the jar. So that's what I use to do my infusions and um, store my herbs. <laughs> so, so most of these are actually herbs. Some of them are um, just other ingredients and then some of these are appliances and supplies that I needed to repurchase. I needed a new <clears throat> immersion blender. I bought a commercial one but that's not going to be here anytime soon so I'm going to use this one in the meantime because the two that I have one of them are broken and having one immersion blender isn't good because once it gets too hot then I gotta wait for it to cool I also bought a new hand mixer for my whipped body butters because I don't like to use the um like the KitchenAid with the bowl and stuff because I do my body butters in such big quantity that everything can fit in that small bowl so I, I prefer to do it by hand until I can get like a big commercial mixer and then this is one of the box of glass, glass jars that came broken and then there's another one on the other side and then some oils this came spilled in the box so I'm gonna tell Amazon about that too um, surfactant, switch hazel just stuff that I need so, anyways, I think that's it for this video, to be honest. Oh, I also got a bunch of jars, I mean bottles, and caps. I need to count them to make sure they send me the correct quantity. Because, I don't know, but this, I ordered like 300 of these caps. Don't look like 300 so i gotta check they have more at the bottom of the bag that i ain't see yet so i have to go through that but anyways i've also put these things away and organized and then start getting my chair ready for bed because it's about that time i'm also hungry so i need to go get something to eat and yeah I don't know if I'll be back on here, so if not, I hope y'all enjoyed this little whatever this is. <laughs> but um, to all my melanated women, protect your womb by any means necessary. And to everyone watching, protect your peace by any means necessary. I wish you all love, light, and prosperity, and you'll see me in my next video. Sit on that throne, queen. Know you got that goddess energy. It's in your soul, queen. Manifesting your reality.